welcome back to the zombie wasteland and yeah we're gonna continue on this house stacks of uh, stairs so we should, that should be enough for now I hope at least but in the corners I want to have full box windows maybe get a glimpse of um, how it will look in the end This is how it will look, but it will be higher. So it will like be, be du duplicated or something. This looks nice, right? It's gonna have uh, one more floor, but I am all out of stone. Unfortunately. So we have to uh, go get some. But first we will leave this stuff we have in our inventory. Alright, oh, I for actually forgot one thing. But we need uh, dirt for that thing. And uh, yes, I forgot to turn off the sound of chrome again. I'm sorry. Hope it's not too much of a problem. Why did I? I'm so silly. 
put away the things that I needed. And it's very soon night, so we should just wait for night first. So that we can sleep it away. Maybe get some good view from here. So that and that, those two are the new houses. And this will be one floor higher, so it will be like that high maybe. We need to put windows in this house. That's what I forgot to do. And the house right across the street behind this thing too. Then um, we need to get stone. I planted some wheat to clone the sheep. And yeah. We made quite some progress now, I think. I think it's good progress considering it's been 35 episodes. We have built the first house in the mountain island. Then we built the zombie fortress out in the water. And now we've built uh, this city. It's of course not even close to finished, but at least we can see some progress and that's always good then we're gonna need to put in like uh, lamps and stuff like uh, street la lamps and we need uh, more those uh, lights I think over here but in this maybe or maybe even in, in this, I'm not sure. Maybe here. I haven't really decided yet. So this is how the inside looks. It's very boring. This is where the floor will be. The entrance hall will be a bit lower than the rest of the floors. And we need to put in glass up here. also need to put in walls in this house which will be out of um, hardened clay unstained so it will have the reddish color Oops. I think whoops is one of my most used words in this in my videos <laughs> Okay, good, that was this house. Let's now do this house over here. And I mentioned before, I'm, I don't know if I'm gonna do the all the interiors or if like, this is of course very demolished, this house. But if I'm understand don't have to explain everything in that much detail or rather I don't have to explain everything a hundred times Then I got popular on Facebook. Why is, it, why is it like that? You like don't get any message, yes, but then you start recording and then you get like hundreds. So yeah. I thought I'd show you um, the mine. Uh, you have seen it before, but uh, it just I haven't haven't done as much on it then. So this is the area I've dug out.
these small slimes are like the cutest mobs ever. They try so hard to hurt you, but they can't. Diamonds. Um, so, yeah. Alright, let's see when I have a lot of stone again. Hello, hello. Welcome back to the mine. So, this is what I've dug up so far while collecting stone and this is what I've got now and uh, yeah about the secret project it have been put on hold because um, uh, when oops no, 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 no. And now I can't, we can't get up. Wait. Let's do some parkouring. Um, yeah, it's been put on hold because when I decided to do it, I was at a st uh, my subscribers rise steadily. And, uh, I was at 82 subscribers and this thing I will explain today what it is won't work with if I don't have a bit more subscribers um, so the idea was to um, if my uh, subscribers would like rise keep rising at the same pace I would be at maybe 120 now but um, when I reached 82, it just started to get um, less again. And now I'm down to 71 by some reason. And I don't know how well it will work with that um, amount of people. Oops. I uh, think it will need more because the thing that I... Um, want to do or that I am doing is to start a server um, yeah. and um, I was planning to have some kind of competition or something to let people join but um, yeah so if there's not enough people to join the competition it's hard to have a competition if you understand and the server will be um, uh, have a gothic theme with uh, like vampire 18th century or um, the medieval uh, medieval theme it will be dark and uh, yeah, uh, and I've made a whole uh, texture pack for the server uh, where I've retextured pretty much all of the things. And uh, yeah, and the um, big uh, building that I've been working on is the town hall at spawn where you can uh, like the players on the server can meet up and stuff but uh, yeah so that will be that is put on hold for a bit I um, yeah uh, I will see the comments in this video if there is a lot of like um, positive feedback I will do it anyways now 
if there's not so much positive feedback, I will wait until I have more subscribers. Or don't do it at all, we'll see. Though I thought I'd uh, show you the texture pack I've done now. Anyways, so it won't like just be in vain. Um, so yeah, here it comes. Welcome back. The um, name of the server will be Asania, which will be the name of the land or world, I should say, that it takes place in. And uh, here we have sand. No. Gravel, I mean. This is sand, of course. This is a desert. And this is grass. And this is dirt without grass. This is stone, this is cobblestone, and mossy cobblestone. These are the woods. And the planks. This is mainly a roof texture. I wanted to have, like, some uh, tiles uh, for a roof. And I wanted to have the jungle wood, a more of a mahogany color and uh, yeah the ores here glass sand sandstone smooth sandstone it looks weird compared to these but I think it looks pretty good like oops, like this um, it's very like borderless that's what I wanted and this is the uh, chiseled sandstone so you can do something like this and I think it looks pretty good this is uh, bricks and uh, yeah oh I forgot this stone bricks cracked chiseled mossy stone slab two slabs look like this. It's the same texture on top and the, the side. I wanted to do that. This is soul sand. This is netherrack. Glowstone. And nether bricks. Pumpkin. The regular pumpkins don't have any face now. Only the jack-o'-lanterns. Melon. And uh, hay. Mycelium. Ice. And these are the wools. All the wools. And here we have cactus, and dead bush, the saplings, the flowers, crafting table, and torch, ladder, sign, bed, pot, um, and this is actually textured the same way. This is a redstone lamp, but I wanted to do the glowstone in the same, uh, like look the same because then you can have l uh, lamps but uh, you don't need any redstone and you can of course turn it off and here you have uh, yep these are bars and uh, panes and uh, wood door and iron door and uh, pressure plates big chest, small chest, chanting table, bookshelf and I've also done the of these um, menu ah. things ah. and if we take this out it will stop soon this isn't retextured but ah. this is and this is working too I haven't retextured ah. the creative menu so what do we need? We need ah. brewing. No, we need materials. Never work. Like so. Ah. Oh these are already awkward. Okay, so what should we do then? Ah. Um sugar. Oops. As ah. you can see it's working and this is now off so it looks like ah. this and the crafting table chests and uh, then we have the this villager 
thing and um, retextured beacon. Whoops, <laughs> that was actually not on purpose. I don't even know where to find it. Okay. And as you can see, this down here is new, and we can um, let's do at least. Okay, so and uh, here, this is uh, how it looks here. And we have items, mushroom, mushroom, carrot, golden carrot, this is potato, baked potato, poisonous potato, apple, golden mm. apple, wheat and seeds, and this is sugar cane, uh, wood tools, iron tools, made uh, this, uh, no stone tools I made them down here, wood and stone. I made this look like a viking axe. And here we have iron and gold. So this is what the gold axe looks like in the and when you hold it and the gold sword and the iron axe which is uh, the same shape as this one because I thought that would make sense. And then we have the diamond weapons and stuff. So this is the axe and this is the sword, which is a bit overkill maybe, but whatever. And the leather armor, uh, chain armor, iron armor, gold armor, diamond armor and, uh, and bow and arrow. So as you can see I've changed the texture on those two and we can start by going over here I think so this is the armors the this armor is pretty much isn't very changed it's a bit changed like the chest looks different and the color is a bit different on this and that and that's a wood sword which I made look made small like more of a dagger then we have the chain armor with a viking axe then we have the iron armor if you can look at us with an iron sword gold armor the gold sword this helm covers the whole face except the eyes and the diamond gear we have like uh, wings on the side of the head and it also covers the whole head I guess I could show them like this uh, leather and iron and it seems pointless to show since they are not that special I show these So this is what it looks like from behind and this is from the front. Now uh, my eyes are in a bit of a weird position so you see the goggles instead of the eyes when you put on the helmet. But I think it looks cool. And then we have this diamond armor and it looks like this from the front damn it wrong button I stopped the recording instead of changing the view and this is what it looks like from behind the um, blue stuff on the arms and the legs are supposed to look like runes but it's really hand on the chest but it's really hard to do in such low uh, resolution Okay, so that was that. Now let's move over to the animals. Pig isn't changed very much, just made it a bit darker and browner. The, pi the sheep 
is much darker too. Cow is um, yeah, pretty much only darker. Maybe a uh, chicken brown instead of white. And what was supposed to be in this one? This is zombie I think, at least. Okay, so this is what zombie looks like. And we have a creeper. The skeleton isn't uh, retextured. The creeper is brown with uh, some big teeth to make it, make it look like it more belongs in this world. The slime is not very exciting, I just made it a little bit darker and less saturated. And we have the Enderman, this is the one with the biggest change I think. And so I made him look like, uh, supposed to look like a vampire. We like it. Yeah. Now the question, what is supposed to be in this? Oh right, it's um, the Ocelot. Oops. <laughs> yeah, as you can see I made it black instead. So let's just... Okay, so yeah, this is the texture pack I made for the Asanya server, which I was going to start, but yeah, I've already talked about that. Don't have to take it twice. So maybe we should uh, fly around a bit, see how it looks. It is supposed to be, uh, yeah, dark, more, much more darker and sinister, I'd say. And the snow is, of course, uh, still white. Have any eyes? Yeah, there. This is what the ice looks like. The reeds. Forgot to put them over there. Squids are not uh, changed. Everything that wasn't over there um, is still the same. Oh, I think I retextured the Coco too, yeah I did. Like this. So yeah, that's it. The, uh, the texture pack for the Sanya server. And I hope you like it. I'll see you back in the zombie world. So this is what it looks like in this texture pack. I haven't retextured any of the quartz. I think it's good as it is. And uh, yeah, th it isn't uh, suited for modern builds. It's more gothic and medieval. And here is a zombie in... Uh, armor, gold armor, and I have a stone sword which is like a dagger, and, like, and I haven't changed the, the those, uh, that, what's it called, clay. So yeah, this is, it isn't suited for this, so it looks a bit weird, but it does give you um, like a feeling of how the texture pack uh, works and stuff. And 
this will of course look weird because it's built out of the wool. So it looks really weird. But it isn't built for this texture pack, so that's why. But yeah, there you have it. If you wanna see the this better. Check out the house over there. Maybe that will work. It's not as modern as the city itself, so it might look really good. Who knows? So this is oops, forgot that hole. Can we do it now? Um, yeah. And if we now change to the source pack to my the uh, my regular one, this is how it looks. So there is quite a big difference between those two packs. We should uh, try to smelt some more stones so that we can continue on our house that we have built on, which need this, needs one more floor. Which is this one. Yeah. And uh, on another topic, so to say, uh, I've actually no, not I've I'm actually uh, gonna buy a new base today. Which is really nice. Gonna order it from the internet, of course, because uh, you can't find what you want in the stores. Since I'm uh, playing uh, extended range instruments usually, uh, and it's a seven-string bass, Ibanez um, BTB, which is beyond the boundaries, I think. Um, BTB seven, and it looks amazing. And I have a friend. Who is uh, who plays seven string bass, and he have a voodoo um, seven string bass. Uh, but he have tried the BTP seven, which is pretty new. I think it came this summer or something. But and he says that it's really really good. Um, that the voodoo is really good, but the Ibanez is perfect. Was his words. So yeah, I'm gonna buy a uh, Ibanez 7 string bass today and I will get it in a week or something and I can't wait, I'm super excited about that it will be real nice and if you don't know I play 6 string bass now so I'm uh, taking it one step up I think it's really nice to have uh, more strings in the uh, higher frequencies, I should say, like um, higher notes. I think B is well enough, it's uh, low enough uh, for a bass. Um, so I don't think you need any lower, but uh, the higher strings is really uh, good and nice to have when you're 
you do chords and tapping and stuff and, and you have a lot, a lot more options which is nice and yeah this will take forever and I think it's been quite a while already so I think we'll, we're gonna have to build in the next episode bye bye